Hey everyone, welcome to a special episode of In the Know with RV Pro. We're coming to you from Louisville, Kentucky at the National RV Trade Show. Right behind me is uh, Keystone RV. We're gonna step into the Cougar to interview CEO Matt Zimmerman. So Keystone RV has experienced some serious growth this year. As a benchmark, uh, you guys delivered your 100,000th Montana fifth wheel in the summer and uh, moved into new offices shortly after. Um, how would you say this year stacked up for Keystone RV against past years? Well, I think you said it best with uh, both of those comments. You know, obviously the growth has, has been tremendous. It's been a phenomenal year for Keystone RV. Um, but I think the real difference maker for us as an organization this year compared to previous years is the amount of investment that we've put into our infrastructure to make sure that we're ready for the future because we see the same amount of uh, growth and demand that we've experienced over the last few years um, continuing. Yeah. And so, you know, over a very short amount of time, we've put up uh, three brand new manufacturing facilities on the Keystone campus. We've remodeled and retooled three additional manufacturing plants on that same campus. On our Dutchman side of our business, They've, uh, over the last really 24 months, ramped up in, into two brand new facilities. Mm -hmm. And then just recently in our Topeka uh, campus with Crossroads, we've uh, also had sizable investments that have retooled all of their production uh, facilities and uh, we're right now getting ready to launch two brand new lines. So uh, that in addition to customer service expansions that we're doing to make sure that we're ready to meet the demand for our end users uh, after the sale uh, with all these other new facilities. We, I think that's the one thing that's really made this year truly different is um, we see a long, long runway, so right. we're getting ready for it. Yeah, so speaking on you know, improving things, uh, both you and Dometic worked on the OmniChill air conditioner that's on the Fusion toy hauler. Um, what was it like collaborating together? Well, it was awesome. It's a great company, yeah. first and foremost. And uh, we're both really, really excited about what that Omni Chill um, feature can do for not only Fusion moving forward, but the rest of uh, our products here at, at Keystone. Um, it, it's a well known fact that, you know, 44 foot trailers, uh, you know, in today's world with the square footage we have with all the slide rooms. Uh, have have a tough time keeping up or, or, or cooling and staying comfortable in some of our most hottest regions when it when it gets blazing hot out and uh, we recognize that um, hey we, we got to do this a little bit better and uh, we collaborated with the medic uh, together we've brought this incredible product to the market that right. um, is just amazing uh, I think we have a theme here at Keystone built for the long haul and um, you know we're doing that in different ways whether it's you know taking towable products and converting every single brand over to a color-coded numbered wiring schematic which there's not another towable brand in our industry that's put that commitment you know out there right um, to make it easier to diagnose any issues down the road or um, maybe just chase wires uh, for whatever purpose that you know somebody might need to do that with uh, but it's things like our air duct joiner systems that have increased the airflow and you know there's other things coming we're, we're getting ready to announce a brand new innovation that we've uh, collaborated with a company on for over 18 months oh, wow. um, nice. and it is going to revolutionize how uh, we connect TVs DVDs stereo systems uh, blu-ray players cable satellite AM FM radio signals so we're really excited oh, about that and yeah. uh, stay tuned that'll be coming out here real quick okay uh, when can we expect that you think uh, right at the first of the year first of the year very nice yes. very mm -hmm. cool um, well yeah we'll keep an eye out yeah. for that that's cool um, well okay so one big thing I, I want to talk about you know the convention this year the trade show um, a major theme is you know preparing to sell more RVs yeah. you know uh, that was the big question at the Outlook 2018 was, you know, are you ready to sell more RVs? And I like that aspect of, are you ready? Um, you know, and I think they're specifically referring to millennials almost. Mm -hmm. um, so how is Keystone RV planning on it, at, attracting the estimated 21 million potential buyers within that age group? Great. Yeah, so certainly you do that through great products. Yeah. And, um, you know, whether it's... Uh, 
products that appeal directly to those uh, millennials, um, like our Rove and Colt product lines that we just recently launched, or maybe it's just features that those millennials or new buyers in general are looking for, uh, app-based technologies, uh, connectivity, um, solar charging, you know, things of that nature. And we certainly are doing all of those. But I think the one thing that you know we're preparing uh, as a company is um, how to give all of these new users or new customers, excuse me, a better experience. Mm -hmm. You know, a lot of them have never RV'd before in their lives. So uh, the worst thing we could possibly do is build them a, a product that they're not comfortable taking out and using and getting the most out of uh, what it can offer them. Right. So we, we're doing that through building products built for the long haul, right? So uh, the color-coded wiring, you know, schematics, the, 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 the features that we're pouring into our products to make sure that, you know, they're of the highest quality, first and foremost. Making sure that we are prepared to service those customers because those buyers especially have different expectations than yeah. um, buyers of, of the past. And so we have to evolve as an organization. We have to evolve as an industry. And uh, we're certainly putting increased pressures on ourselves by upping our shipment goals of parts, making sure that we answer the phone even better than what we do today, which we think we do it phenomenal. But we recognize none of that is still good. So, yeah. you know, we shoot, we're shooting for every single part order out our door in 48 hours or less. And, and we do achieve that 85% of the time. 85% of the time, 48 hours or less. That's not good enough. We need to even get better. So um, we're focused on delivering unbelievable service support. We're focused on videos, how-to videos. So right. a consumer that's never, ever RV'd before, if he's out using his RV for the first time or second time, and maybe it's the first time he's using that particular feature and doesn't really quite understand it, we want easy access for him to gain knowledge, be able to use the fun you know use that function on his RV, and have a really, really good experience. So yeah. um, those are the things that we're focused on as an organization. Outside of just product innovation and you know new product lines, it's really the overall experience that we give those customers, because that truly, will drive our industry for many, many years, you know, past today. Absolutely. Well, you talk about videos, you talk about, um, I mean, you guys introduced, you know, 360 videos that I thought were amazing. Those VR videos are great. And, you know, one of our editors uh, at RV Pro, Travis Pryor, actually wrote a little story about, like, one way of appealing to millennials is through video. Because, like, almost like, on, you know, they're online. Yeah. So, um, Basically, when they go out in the lot, they know what they want already. <laughs> they've either t seen the videos, they've Absolutely. gone to the VR tours. So I think you guys are pretty on point with that. Absolutely. You know? <laughs> well, there's always so much more we can do. And yeah. We're certainly focused on it. Uh, we've got an unbelievable team here, and um, whether it's virtual, you know, reality floor plans. So um, yeah. if if it's not sitting on, you know, the dealer's lot, that that end user has an opportunity to get inside that coach and really walk through it and look up, down, inside, out. And um, so we're doing those things, as you mentioned, but we're just trying to make that experience, you know, the best it possibly can be. We have a, we have a key connect department here at our organization that um, is dedicated to just taking phone calls for potential buyers. Right. These new oh, buyers cool. that are really shopping, as you mentioned, and yeah. they're, they're getting interested in it and they just have some questions. Maybe they're not quite ready to go to the dealership Maybe they just want to go right to the manufacturer because that's what they're used to. We're engaging them digitally. We're engaging them on the phone. We're answering their questions, um, and then ultimately, you know, delivering them to you know our, our dealer partners who take great care of them after you know for the sale and after the sale. So, we're doing different things that we've never done as an organization to uh, really, again, at the end of the day, just give an ultimate experience to the the new buyers that are coming in. So. Absolutely. Yeah. Cool. Well, Matt, thank you so much for being on In The Know. Thank you.